guys, it's Chloe. Welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, thank you so much for stopping by. So, today, very exciting. I'm doing a huge Pretty Little Thing haul. I don't think I've done a PLT haul in a while, so this is very exciting. Everything in this haul has actually been gifted to me, which I cannot express just how grateful I am. PLT has been one of my fave brands for years and the fact that they contacted me and sent me all of this stuff is just insane. So a massive thank you to PLT for making that happen. That's I just... will like never be over things like this. So yeah, thank you so much. If you like anything that you see on here, I will leave everything linked down below so you can just really quickly tap and shop it straight away. Also, a little bit of self promo here, but if you don't follow me on my Instagram, I usually pop it on the screen at some point anyway, but I will leave it linked down below. I do loads of outfit posts on there and I tag everything. So if you want to see how I style some of these pieces up, definitely head over to my- First item I'm going to show you before I forget is of course a pair of shoes. This is just so exciting. Little babies. I feel like these are going to be a love-hate kind of shoe, but I think these are gorgeous. They are a burgundy croc print held boot and I'm just absolutely obsessed. So the heel looks pretty big but I always like these block heels because they're super easy to walk in, really comfy compared to like a super thin heel that you'd wear on a night Or just I love the like glossy sheen to it, croc print, I'm here for it. This colour, awesome winter in a shoe. So very excited to dress the most basic outfits up with this. I'm just envisioning a huge chunky knit white like cream jumper, a pair of ripped black jeans or leather leggings and these are oh, such a vibe these are honestly gorgeous i can't remember the prices of everything so of course i will link them down below and then you can just click on that and see the price because plt often have like sales on and stuff but yeah gorgeous these are a size five by the way and they fit perfectly obsessed with this item this is the uh, ivory ruched front knitted midi skirt in small now literally when i'm holding it up it just looks like a piece of material so in the try on clips you'll be able to see it properly it's just this gorgeous cream kind of colored skirt it's got a super stretchy waist which i'm here for anything with like an elasticated or stretchy waist is a 10 out of 10 from me. I have actually tried this one on already. I'm obsessed with it, can't wait to show you guys, but it is a little, well, when I say a little bit see-through, it's very see-through. So Defo, get some similar, like, color underwear if you can, because yeah, these are see-through. I don't usually go for midi skirts. I tend to go for something a bit shorter because I don't have the longest legs. So, this is a bit different for me. I know it seems pretty basic, but I feel like everyone needs one of these in their autumn winter wardrobe. Dress it up with boots or heels, wear it with chunky trainers and like a leather jacket, which I probably will do. And the best thing is that you can rouge it. So you've got this little bit at the side, pull it. Being very washed out by the ring light. I do apologize, but like I said, you will see it in the try on clips. So let's go and try that one on now. Okay, so after literally having to dig through my underwear drawer and try and find something that's suitable to this color, I think I finally found something. Please just ignore if not. I have got the skirt on, so obviously I'm gonna show you guys in the cropped my little vest top that I was wearing. I would wear it with a different top. I think a crop top would look nice, but I was just lazy, so this is what I've gone for. But this is what the skirt looks like. I think it is so beautiful. I love the ruched detailing down the side. I did get this in an eight and it fits perfectly. There's definitely some room, which I love. If I just turn around and show you the back, item is actually super basic but I love it so much because depending on what trousers or shoes you pair it with you can really dress it up or down so it's just this grey kind of oversized tee so it says motorcycle club in the corner here I love like little t-shirts which have like prints and logos and things on them like vintagey style ones just I'm obsessed with that whole kind of vibe. I have like a charcoal -y grey colour and I got this in a small which I think they only did small, medium and large but they do come oversized anyway. So I would probably wear this tucked like half in, half out with a pair of jeans or something. I feel like you can't really go wrong with a t-shirt from PLT just because they're always really nice quality. They wash really well and yeah they just last for such a long time. So this will be a staple I think because like I said I love these kind of like vintage style t-shirts. So here I have paired the motorcycle tee with the jeans that I've showed you and I've put a pair of heels on just to show you how you can kind of dress this up and I absolutely love it. I love the bottom of the jeans as well, like honestly I cannot get over them. So 
So I picked out these straight legged jeans. I actually worn these out once, hence why the tag is not on here. And I can 10 out of 10 confirm that these are the comfiest jeans ever. They're so flattering, fit so nicely. I stuck to my usual size, which is an eight, and honestly can't fault these at all. I feel like they look really flattering on the bum as well. Like, Cause I definitely haven't been doing anything to get it looking good. I haven't stepped foot in the gym in about three months. So I that's PLT for the bum lift. So we've got two little pockets on the back. Really gorgeous kind of like dark denim wash with extreme rips here and love there. the bottom details of these jeans they are so gorgeous they're really really distressed here love it i just think these look so cool the best thing about these straight leg jeans are that you they kind of come above the ankles so you can wear like a pair of heels and instead of you know when you want to wear heels with jeans but sometimes they look stupid rolling them up but if you want to wear the full heel you have to pull the jean over it i don't know i can't explain but it just looks really kind of odd um you can show off your heels in their full glory whilst not having to roll these up and oh, i'm just so obsessed with these i love them i don't think i've ever loved a pair of like dark denim wash jeans more than these ones they are incredible i've actually taken the tag off of these obviously because i've worn them but i think they were called something like the chloe distressed hem straight leg jean or something again it will be linked down below so you will be able to find them if you do like them then have this scarlet square neck puffed sleeve top i think this is the sweetest thing ever it's so cute i'm really obsessed with like the puff sleeve vibe at the moment i just think it's adorable because you can wear it kind of like how it's supposed to be the puffed sleeves on the shoulders but you can kind of put it down to the side a little bit and i still think it looks super cute that is gorge perfect for autumn winter it's just that really nice burgundy kind of color i think i would probably pair this with a pair of like leather trousers and yeah i mean to be honest wear it with heels or trainers and i feel like this is gonna look so nice definitely again another one that you could dress up or dress down i feel like everything i've picked up is easily dressed up or casual don't yeah. really really like this super stretchy material as well so you can kind of have room to move it's not going to be too restricting and it is pretty cropped but i feel like it's a decent kind of crop i think the square neckline is really nice i have quite broad shoulders so sometimes i don't know if things like this suit me however i really like how this one looks super comfy the material is nice it's not itchy or anything and I just feel like this is going to be such a staple throughout the next couple of months. Can you guys let me know what you think of this top? Because I actually think it's really cute, but I'm not sure if I pull it off. So in the nicest way possible, let me know. Um, but I have just paired it with this white skirt and it's low-key a vibe. Like, I just throw it on, not planning on showing you the skirt with it. But I think it's cute. Let me know what you think of it as an outfit. Really loving the collar on this one as well. It's not like super high or anything, but it's just very nice and love the sleeves. Obviously they're kind of like a big balloon kind of sleeve and then it goes cuffed in at the wrist. Just think this is so beautiful. Again, I'd probably pair this with black leather trousers or something along those lines. Just a really easy one that you could wear, probably not every day because it is very cropped, but really beautiful color, absolutely love it. The model looked insane in this. I think she was wearing it with like a black leather skirt and like knee high boots and honestly, 10 out of 10 like that outfit combination is so adorable so i don't think i'm going to be pulling that one off or nowhere near as well as the model did but really lovely like outfit combinations you can do with this one this is what the red fisherman jumper looks like on it is super cropped but i've paired it with a pair of jeans and i think this looks so so nice you could actually probably get away with wearing this with joggers like a grey pair or a really nice cream pair of joggers and have it as more of a like relaxed outfit but yeah no so far i really like how it looks with jeans uh, i have a black blazer and i think if i can remember rightly i have like a checked blazer from last year if not, I'm definitely going to look into buying one because they are beaut. However, I saw this on the website and I was just like, oh my god, I need this. This is such an all year round blazer. 
This will look so cute in spring summer, but it's also perfect for autumn winter as I well. Love I love an oversized blazer. They're just my favorite thing at the moment. It's a size eight pink oversized button detail blazer. So it's got the little like tortoise shell buttons running down both sides, which I think is just so cute. It's a really nice material. It's very stretchy. It's kind of thin, so you wouldn't really throw it on for like warmth, but I feel like you don't really do that with a blazer anyway. I'm trying to picture so many outfits that I would wear this with. I think with leather, trousers and heels this is obviously going to be the best combination probably just like a white silky satiny kind of blouse or bralette or corset underneath this is going to look so nice i feel like blazers can really dress your outfits up and make something that's probably a little bit more like clubby look a bit more classy if you were going out for like dinner or you had a meeting or something so yeah very very happy with this one i love the color and just blazers are my thing at the moment Then going in for something a little bit more glam. Okay. How do I even begin to show this? I picked up the most gorgeous red ruched dress. Kind of got a thing for ruching at the moment. Ruching, is that a word? Ruching, ruching, ruching. My fashion vocabulary is not on point. For someone that does this many clothing hauls and buys clothes so often, I really need like a little fashion bible kind of dictionary because this is not it. It's just not it. I'm a disgrace. So this is the Shape Scarlet Slinky Wrap Detail Rouge Dress in a size 8. Yeah, like I said, this is shapewear as well. So this is supposed to be super flattering to kind of the chin, suck in, snatch the waist and just make everyone look absolutely flawless. I love the colour. I do love red, especially when I've got fake tan on, which I don't at the moment. But a nice dark fake tan. I feel like red goes really nicely with like blonde or like whitey blonde kind of hair as well. So yeah, I do feel like I enjoy wearing red quite a lot. So this will be a nice one to wear out to the club. Also, if you've got a red lipstick, I feel like MAC Ruby Woo matches this colour so nicely. So dream team combo. It actually feels kind of heavy, which is a good sign because it means it's going to be a really nice quality. We've only gone and picked up a huge ass coat. Would it be a PLT haul unless you've had a browse through their jacket and coat section? This is the softest thing ever. Like honestly, like a little duvet, I'm obsessed. I just wanna wrap myself in this and watch a movie. So this is the Black Faux Fur Double Breasted Button Detail Coat. This is a size eight, so oversized. So I'm an eight, but I probably could have got this in a six if I wanted it a little bit more fitted but i really like my coats oversized i just feel like that's part of the fun of them in like autumn winter when it's cold to have something oversized to keep you like extra warm and just be super cozy again also if you're wearing like jumpers and things underneath the coat you want to be able to fit in it without it looking stupid whereas if you're wearing one that's a coat that's too tight you're going to be super uncomfortable in like a thick jumper underneath and stuff so it's got pockets at the side which i love and we've then just got these big tortoise shell buttons. I just cannot tell you guys how soft this is. It is so beautiful as well. And I just think the length and size of it is perfect. Again, because it's such a big kind of, it's not a statement coat. It's not like a big bright colour. But because it is so big and kind of like heavy. Ooh, jeans and a t-shirt. You're going to dress this up in no time by throwing this one on. And I just love that coats have like the ability to dress up an outfit. I obviously feel like a giant teddy bear in this coat. It is so warm and cozy. I'm obsessed. So guys, that is the end of today's haul. I really hope you enjoyed it. Again, massive thank you to PLT for sending me all of this stuff. I'm so excited to get out and wear all of this and take all my Instagram pictures in it. So don't forget to follow my Instagram. I will pop it on the screen and leave it linked down Please below. Please don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up and subscribe down below if you're new here. And feel free to leave me some more video ideas. I've got a couple other clothing hauls coming up soon, which is very exciting, but I'm always open to hearing your ideas. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one.